right, a blustery Monday afternoon. It's been a little bit damp from time to time. We had some patchy light rain very early this morning and just from time to time late morning through the afternoon with this low overcast. We've had a little bit of spotty drizzle as well, just enough to make it ugh, out there and it's going to stay that way. So if you have some outdoor plans, you know the drill Old man winter trying to come back after what turned out to be a beautiful spring like weekend. Now overcast conditions live look from the Bristol back towards beautiful downtown Louisville, the second street bridge, the Ohio River there still running a bit high, but it is dropping uh, 45 to 47 is now the range just a couple of days ago. We were flirting with the 70 degree mark and yesterday into the 60s as well. Well, reality here back into the middle and upper 40s right now. Humidity 80% a northwest breeze in here at 12. I mean, considering it's late January, it could be a whole lot worse, as you know. But still, after you enjoy a weekend like we had, it kind of stings when you walk outside with that breeze. That's for sure. Hey, radar scans are pretty much on the clear side. What you don't see is the spot or two of drizzle that's out there. And again, with the low clouds in place, we're going to hold on to that forecast as we move through the overnight period. What a change. Temperatures all across the Ohio Valley back into the 40s, the low and middle 40s for the most part, with kind of a stiff north and northwesterly breeze. Big storm system is wrapping up on the eastern seaboard right now, producing a mixture of rain and snow in Pennsylvania. Same storm system that produced all the severe weather, the deadly tornadoes across the deep south. We were kind of in between on this system with the real cold air off to the north. That's why we enjoyed a beautiful weekend and all the big time thunderstorm activity off to our south. Now what's going on is the low pressure system is spinning up off to the east of us. It's pulling in some strong north breezes and as a result the temperatures have been cooling off with those winds coming in from Canada. So as we move through the evening, as we move through the overnight, again, a spot or two of drizzle possible. Otherwise, we'll hold on to these low clouds and temperatures will be chilly, but well above freezing. Not worried about any icy spots whatsoever. Matter of fact, we'll wake up to the upper 30s and lower 40s on your Tuesday morning, expecting 41 right here in the metro. Now, don't expect a lot of sunshine tomorrow, especially the first half of the day. I think those low clouds will still be around the region. Then as we move towards late afternoon, probably after three o'clock or so, we'll start to see a clearing trend from southwest to northeast and it will feel a little bit better. The winds will be much lighter as we head into tomorrow afternoon and high temperatures in your hometown about where they should be for the time of year, if not a little bit better than that. So we're still doing OK for late January here. We're back in the upper 40s, possibly near 50 across uh, much of the viewing area, expecting 48 right here in the metro and things will get progressively colder as we move into the latter half of this work week not expecting any big snowstorms but certainly a flurry or two cannot be ruled out especially by friday here are the forecast details now chilly this evening cloudy skies watch out for a spot or two of light drizzle nothing more than that will be dropping slowly through the 40s down to 43 at 10 o'clock tonight in the morning we will wake up gray overcast and kind of chilly with temperatures around 41 30s in some of the outlying regions midday tomorrow ugh, not much improvement still overcast and 45 and then later in the afternoon tomorrow we'll squeak out some sunshine we go up to 48 Wednesday a brief warm up there will be a chance for a midday shower just ahead of a cold front as we climb to 61 and behind that front it cools off significantly with highs a mix of upper 30s and lower 40s Thursday through next Monday and lows at night in the 20s and lower 30s and there's that chance for a flurry on Friday again on Sunday but nothing more than that.